Hi guys, Glader here. So today I have another video on the Free Craft Core Proxy that I've been working on for the past few days. And today, we're actually going to use this tool to log into a vanilla server and enter the world. All on a 3.3.5 client, which I've got up over here. And I'm on a vanilla server over here. In fact, I'm on a, a new community-driven server called Phoenix. Apparently it's a few of the old community members started up a server with the old name. And this is just a vanilla server I'm going to test it on. So there's a few people here. And I've got the proxy running right here. So we're just going to log in. And maybe I'll talk a little bit about the technical details at the end. Now we need the process ID. And that should disconnect us. Alright. You can see we're at the character screen on the Wrath of Lich King client connected to the vanilla server. And we'll just go ahead and enter the world here. You can actually, you can click on the other characters and stuff. I think it looks slightly better, I'm not sure. I think I don't know if the models are different. So let's go ahead and log in. And things just barely work, so bear with me. Okay, so we should be able to look around. So you can see there's one person over here. He's unknown uh, because <laughs> things are completely finished. This is the first. This is the, like the first hour I've been able to log into the world. But there you have it. We're we're on a vanilla server right now, logged into the world. All thanks to this tool on the side, which proxies the packets and modifies the content so that it fits the vanilla and RAF formats going in and out vice versa. So none of this would have been possible without the incredible work that the Mangos and Trinity Core developers over the years have done for the reverse engineering of the client. So all this information is based on it. And yeah, so that this is this is something I think could be interesting, being able to log into several different versions of the game with a single client. And I guess we'll see where that takes us. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next video.